was serving them raw, just on a plate with a bunch of um, burned eggplant hummus. Whole like this? Oh, that yeah, is so good. good. If it's not here, it's not like I'm gonna order it from California. It's just not on the menu. Freshness and flavor being paramount when you're um, involved in ingredient-driven food. Um, this is the place to the place to be. To talk about the needs that we have for plant breeding, so varieties that perform better on organic farms for our farmers, um, that have superior culinary qualities like flavor, texture. Um, and just culinary application in general. And we're just looking at ones that are super tight and like heavy for their size. Oh yeah. It could be shape where uh, it's a rounded shoulders like in the stocky red roaster that have rounded shoulders rather than sunk shoulders. A lot easier uh, and quicker to to process in the kitchen. So 20 years of corn. I've had this variety before. It's super sweet and um, Chris and Amy over at Square Peg have very, very high standards on what they'll even bring to the market. Consumers don't have to spend a lot of time thinking about what variety that they they want to buy or which one's going to actually taste the best, but that the farmers actually have that information by being involved in these projects and now working a lot closer with seed growers and with chefs. To so sort of push vegetables forward in terms of flavor, in terms of aesthetics, in terms of you know textures that that are desirable that we're looking for.